Hey YouTubers, how's it going? Um, I just wanted to talk to you just for a second. Um, something's been on my mind. This has been bothering me a little bit. It's strange, one of those things. You know how, like, uh, guys, I, I'm really speaking to the guys out there. Do you know how, let's see, if you're in a relationship, uh, your girlfriend or your wife is always just nagging you to put the seat down after you put it up? Or, uh, uh, guys, if you, you know, when you live at home with, with, your, with your mom or if you have female roommates or something, they're, they're asking you the same thing. They're like, put the seat down, you know, when, when you're finished. And I, I, that always annoyed me. It just always bothered me. Women get so upset about the bathroom seat, the, you know, the little toilet ring being up as opposed to down uh, when they go into the bathroom. I've got some things to say about that. First of all, first of all, you're lucky we put it up, okay? You are lucky we put it up. If we didn't put it up, our uh, random spatters of urine would go all around the ring of the seat, okay? And then you'd have to sit in that. What then? What then? Then you'd really be mad. That's right. It wouldn't just be a little annoyance like, oh, gosh, Don didn't put the seat back down. No, it'd be, ugh, Don's urine is on the back of my thighs, and now I can't pull my pants up because they keep sticking before I can get them up all the way. Yeah, it'd be one of those. So you know what? First of all, we need some recognition for that, that we at least get the seat up before we do our business. Second of all, you want us to put it back, right? You just want, you just asked me to put it up, you know, to protect you, and now you're like, well, put it back down. Let's put it back down. And I never understood, like, why it was such a big deal. So then, so then, you know, I ask, and uh, I got some, I got some answers. First of all, uh, some of them just say, it's an inconvenience. It's an inconvenience that I have to walk in, and I'm going to do my business, and I have to put the seat back down. I just have to remember to put the seat back down every single time. And it's not an inconvenience for us to put the seat up every time. We have to put the seat up every time. We're going through a process. You should go through a process. Go through a process. Second complaint that I got. That'd be two. Not one. Two. Two. Second. We might fall in. If I go to sit down, I might, I might fall in the toilet because the seat... The seat is not down, and it's like a vortex. It's like this huge black hole that my bottom will just get sucked into, and I'll just never come back, and I'll never see my family and friends again, and that'll be it. That'll be all done and be finished. No, that's, that's the most ridiculous thing I've ever seen. You go into the bathroom. When you have something to do in there, it's one, there's one purpose, and you know where you're going. You're going, and for women, you have no choice but to sit, okay? Number one or number two, you are sitting. Right? And so your number one priority should be, let me look and see if the seat is down. Let me pay attention. If you don't even look to see if the seat is down before you sit, you deserve to fall in the toilet. You should fall in the toilet and get that water all around your, you know, regions nether-wise. Okay? And so that's for those women. Secondly, um, secondly, I don't even, definitely not secondly, I'm my list, I don't even know where I am on my list anymore. Uh, anyways, I, I, and now I, so those are the top complaints, but I imagine there might be others. I was trying to brainstorm uh, what the others could be, like uh, maybe some women just have like ridiculous back pain, and so like when they bend over constantly, their lower back hurts and they have this chronic back pain. And all I have to say to them is, you know, you're supposed to bend from the knees. Bend from the knees, lift with the legs, you know, you do what you, you know, you just from the legs. Um, some women, let's see, are you upset that you are so busted and disgusting that you see your reflection in the toilet water? You know, because it's not like windy, there's not a, there's not a tide of toilet water that distorts the reflection in the water, and so now you're, you're, you're confronted with your reflection, and you know, you might have a, a pimple here, or maybe you have a birthmark that contains, like, one quarter of your face that you just can't bear to look at so when you look down in the toilet water to put the seat back down it just disgusts you and you feel shame and why was I born this way I don't know that was just I was just brainstorming does the toilet water smell I don't know does it 
Does it stink? If your man doesn't flush, uh, you know, that's a problem. I'm gonna put that one on the man, you know, it, you, you can leave the seat up, but you gotta flush, flush, you know. I mean, they say one, leave it mellow, two, uh, uh, if it's brown, flush it down. But, uh, you know, really, uh, urine starts to stink after a while, so you definitely have to flush that. Okay, definitely gotta flush that. Um, so maybe that's an issue. Are you afraid you're going to slip and fall? Maybe you should put the slip and slide in the backyard as opposed to in your bathroom? I don't know. Don't put cellophane on your feet as slippers. I don't really know where I'm going with that. I should have ended a little while ago because these last two, they just weren't very good. Anyways, I just want to say in closing, okay, ladies? Thank your man for putting the seat up, okay? And just... Gently remind, you know, or ask, would you would you mind putting the feet down after you're finished, honey? It just it would be so awesome. But you are, I appreciate you putting it up because that's the greatest. Because I hate, I hate urine on the back of my thighs, and so you know, thank you very much for doing that. But if you could, just put it put it back down when you're finished. You know, do, do something a little gentle like that. Don't yell, okay? Don't yell because that makes us want to just you know, keep it down and then just aim so that it goes around the seat. We're just going to coat the seat with a nice film of urine, you know. And you don't want your man to do that just to get back at you. You just, you don't want that, okay? So next time before you yell, just think about it for a second, okay? Just think about it.